All right, I'd like you to welcome you to uh, 1416 Patapsco Street here in Baltimore City. We're at a uh, middle unit row home here, nicely, uh, nicely, nicely uh, furnished and finished uh, row home here in Baltimore City. We've got the nice uh, decorative accents for the uh, the street itself. It's a quiet street here in Baltimore City. Got an entire brick, brick front on this house with nice accents for the gables at the top of the roof, including the uh, nice oversized windows here. I'm going to walk you into the first floor of the house. This is a three level house here, middle unit row home again at 1416 Patapsco. You'll see the wrought iron uh, front storm door leading into. A nicely accented brick wall here for the inner and uh, inner walls of the actual uh, row home itself. We have all hardwood floors throughout. Here in the entryway, we also have a tile uh, foyer, um, so that way, coming in with your shoes a little muddy, you have a little entrance for a uh, a foyer. As you can see. It's nicely painted, a beautiful fireplace, probably dates the house as well. It's, it's a beautiful home here in the front, uh, front family room. We have the nice lighting and the recessed lights in the ceiling. I'm going to give you another shot of the open floor concept here on the first floor. You can see that the kitchen's next. But you also have this exposed brick wall, which I think is a kind of a trademark of uh, Baltimore City, leaving the exposed brick with the nice eight-inch baseboards along the uh, along the base of it, headed into that nice hardwood floors. You can see the old wood railings and the old wood floors leading to the upstairs of the second floor of this house. Nice chair rail in the dining room leading into the open floor concept uh, with a little bar um, kitchen in this house. Nice lighting, you can see it's a very very light feeling here with a lot of natural light that enters into the home. Again it's a middle unit row home here in Baltimore City. Rather new appliances, the countertops, the backsplash in black really makes this kitchen pop and stand out with the rich colors. Rich colors of the cabinetry and the glass front uh, doors on. Double door refrigerator, a large refrigerator in here with the ice maker and also the water dispenser. You've got gas, natural gas stove here with your microwave combo on the top. Again, hardwoods follow us through the entire house. And to the rear of the house you have the first of Two and a half baths, this is the half bath. You also have laundry hook up here with a laundry room headed out to the back. As we step down, we step down on the hardwoods again. I'm gonna show you this back a deck because you have a nice entertaining deck here in the back of the house, all stained in that nice red cherry look, all fenced in as well. You have the little cobblestones for a back entry into the house where you could park your one car uh, with ample room to store tools or your barbecue here on this deck. Nice outside deck for entertaining. I'm going to turn back over to the right. I'm going to show you this half bath with the laundry in here as well. So you have enough space for laundry, but you also have your toilet and your vanity in here as well. Nice tiled. Tuscan style, a 12 by 12 or a six, actually it's a 12 by 12 tile here on the floor. Really a masculine color um, which makes the floor pop even more as you transition into the hardwoods. As we head back through I'm going to give you another shot, headed out to the front of the house. I'm going to head up, I'm going to head upstairs first. Actually you know what, I'm going to give you a downstairs look because you do have a family room in here plus a mechanical room leading into the basement. All central air, central heat in this home. 
This is the basement door. It's fully carpeted down here to a fully finished family room with built-ins as well for a desk and an office down here. A lot of storage space here in this, this home. A lot of storage space and some closet uh, shelving as well. You'll see this built-in. Don't hold it against them, but the previous owners were Baltimore Ravens fans. Obviously living here in Baltimore. You wouldn't expect any less. You have a built-in desk here as well. And you've got your recessed lighting in the ceiling. We'll turn back around. We'll head into the, uh, the, the mechanical room in the house where you'll see newer heating system, newer hot water heater, all of your... It's a large room for ample space for storage. You have a lot of storage here in this, this home. As we lead back up, I'm going to lead you back through. We're going to head back upstairs. So you can see the second floor of the house. That's where you have your two bedrooms. Again, this is a this is a two bedroom. However, they are large bedrooms. We'll turn back around. Show you a little bit of this wood railing that leads you up to the second floor. Another piece of exposed brick here. Again, we have recessed lighting. And you also have a nice skylight to the outside with a vent, pull string handle on it. Truly is a, a, a very handsome home here. As we head upstairs, we have some more hardwood. I'm going to take you into the whole bathroom. This is a full bath here on the second level. This is uh, for the second bedroom and also a hall bathroom. You have your, your toilet, your vanity, and you have a nice large size shower in here. These are more of the 6x6 six six tiles in here. Nice color. I'm going to turn this light on real quick. Don't mind that fan. You've got your ventilation for this. Beautiful bath. With a stand up shower. I'm going to back us back out again. Turn that light off. Head into the first of the two bedrooms here. As you can see, the natural lighting is in abundance in this home with those large oversized windows. We also have the, the ample lighting from the recessed lights, the ceiling fan, all carpet. Up here you've got three inch baseboard and a two louver door closet with ample closet space. And we'll walk you back around. I want to show you this huge master bedroom. Give you a look at this brick as well. And how the, the hardwoods transition up here. From the transition into the, the carpeting on this level. A lot of light in this master bedroom. A lot of closet space. You have the his and her closet doors. You have the recessed lights in the ceiling. You have the ceiling fan. Really a beautiful home. Plenty of space for your large oversized beds. And then you head into the master bath. Again, the six by six tiles in here. The his and her sinks. And then in here we have a jacuzzi tub with the jets in there. And you have the ceramic tile from tub to ceiling. Really a beautiful, beautiful home. An oversized shower head. Give you that rain effect. It's really a beautiful, beautiful home. 
Well, I thank you very much for joining me today. And again, this one is for sale here in Baltimore City. Come out and visit us. Take this video tour.